If you haven't heard the news, Jeremy Clarkson has been suspended and potentially fired. If you don't know who he is, he's the host of the greatest car show in the world. What he did is what people are describing as a fracas. Suspended by the BBC following a fracas with a producer, according to a report from the BBC. Fracas. A brawl. Or in other terms, he punched a guy because he was late with his food. It wasn't his fault, he was hungry. This wasn't his first offense either. On May 1st of last year, he was the N-word on national television. Top Gear is the shit. And without Jezza, the show would be shit. Richard Hammond and James May, the other two hosts on the show said, if Jezza goes, they go. The three of them together are like the Three Stooges. Or what Radbot1 says, the three of them are like a three-legged table. Take any of them away and it falls down. Anyways, there's an online petition to keep him. It's just reached a million. There's another one against him. But only has 805. That proves that we love him even though he did cause physical harm to someone. I wanted to see what people thought of him, so I decided to ask 50 people. Jeremy Clarkson should be suspended. Jeremy Clarkson shouldn't be suspended. Or who's Jeremy Clarkson? I came back with the results, and this is what I found. After asking 50 people, 76% didn't know who he was, 6 wanted to keep him, 18 didn't. I decided to spray paint my cars to prove this. Green was Jeremy Clarkson should be suspended permanently. White was Jeremy Clarkson shouldn't be suspended permanently. And red was who's Jeremy Clarkson. 38, 9, and 3. Those were the results. But after I told people what Jeremy did, the majority switched to suspend him. The results were not accurate enough, so I decided to ask another 50 people. Do you think Jeremy Clarkson should be fired? Should Jeremy Clarkson be on top gear with no more warning? Or who's Jeremy Clarkson? Sadly, after only asking 7 people, I found out the inevitable. It is with great regret that I have told Jeremy Clarkson today the BBC will not be renewing his contract. Will not be renewing his contract. He got fired. I then realized I couldn't just sit around and mope. I had to do something. I decided to write a letter. Five, actually. Dear Top Gear, me and millions of fans are pleading for you to bring Jeremy back for us to enjoy. Let bygones be bygones. Bury the hatchet, wipe a clean slate, and forgive the man. Sincerely, Top Gear viewer. And the rest were in the producer's hands. <laughs>